What's up you guys and welcome back to a brand new MC Mod Showcase YouTube video. Today, we're starting the brand new Daily Minecraft Mod series, which will be uploaded on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Today's first ever featured comment is from Pikmin and says, I love your videos on TikTok. Thank you so much for the kind words, and yeah, most of you guys are from TikTok, so I really appreciate you taking the time to watch my YouTube videos as well. As always, I'll have the mods and timestamps in the description of this video. So, with that out of the way, let's get straight into the mods. Our first mod we have today is the To The Bat Pulls mod. Have you ever had it where you place ladders down to a mine, cave, or your bunker and it just slows everything down? Sometimes even placing water under your ladder can be annoying, since you may sometimes miss and fall to your death. With this new mod installed, you won't be having that problem anymore. This mod adds poles that you can craft in many different resources as well. These poles are much more stylish when you jump on them, since it shows an animation of you riding down the pole in third person. A nice feature that the developer added was making it very easy to place these poles by simply stacking it from the ground, making the pole stack up. Now you may think, how would I go back up to where I started? I have an answer for that, and that is the redstone pole variant. By placing the redstone variant down, you will now be able to lift up by powering the pole with something like a button or a lever. You will then fly right back up to where you started. This mod is a very neat mod that just gives the player a bit more entertainment when doing the task of going up and down from a cave and your home. I think many of you will like the second mod we have on this list. The Caracal mod, aka the Big Floppa mod, adds the real life Caracal animal into Minecraft. If you don't know what a Caracal is, they essentially are a very big life size cat that looks aggressive at first but are actually very friendly. These guys will spawn exclusively in the savanna biomes in your world. Approaching one of these Caracals is like approaching up to a wolf. Instead of bones, Caracals like raw fish, raw chicken, or raw rabbit. Any of these foods will work on them to tame them. Once they are tamed, they will start to follow you around just like any other pet will do in Minecraft. You can even make a baby Caracal by feeding two adult Caracals. The best feature in this mod is probably when they sleep with you. When you go to bed at night, your Caracal pet will come up to you and lie down on top of you to sleep with you. Props to the developer for making the Big Floppa meme not just a joke, but an actual mod that fits Minecraft extremely well. The next mod we have is the Straw Golems mod. Straw Golems are a brand new friendly creature who help you do multiple things at once. In order to spawn a Straw Golem, you will need to first grow some wheat to make a block of hay. You will then need to retrieve a carved pumpkin. Once you have these two items, all you need to do is place the block of hay and then place the carved pumpkin on top, giving life to the brand new straw golem. These straw golems are very cute and provide usefulness. These new tiny golems will start harvesting any of your crops that are nearby the golem, and they will place your crops into a designated chest nearby. You can also feed straw golems apples to help bring their health back up if they took any damage. This is such a cute and helpful mod that many players will find lots of joy in. Our fourth mod we have on this list is a fairly simple armor and weapons mod. The Amethyst Equipment mod brings new armor, tools, and weapons for the already existing Amethyst ore in Minecraft. Currently, there isn't too much you can do with Amethyst, but with this mod, you can build some stylish looking tools. Now, since Amethyst is fairly easy to get however, your tools and armor don't last very long. For instance, your tools are equal to diamond mining speeds, but only have 5 uses until it already breaks, which makes it much worse than gold. Your armor is also scaled between iron and diamond for protection, but will break after just 5 hits. You can also craft horse armor, that way you and your horse both look really cool and purple. The new equipment is pretty weak, but if you put a lot of enchantments on these new items, you can potentially have some good stuff for your amethyst equipment. Our final mod we have for today is one of the most simple mods that you can think of. The continue button mod adds a brand new continue option in the main menu rather than clicking single player and selecting your world. This new continue button is probably one of the most useful and simple mods I've ever seen, yet is a feature that makes you think why isn't this already a vanilla feature? And that is all we have for today for the very first Daily Minecraft mod series. Thank you all for the support. At the time of recording this, we're now at 11,000 subscribers. So again, 
Thank you guys so much for the support. If you enjoyed this video, then make sure to subscribe and turn your notifications on since this is only the beginning of the series. I'll see you guys on Wednesday with another Daily Minecraft Mons video.